hey everyone welcome back to my video in the part final so in this part we're going to learn about xml language in the android studio but first we go back to the sketch and i need to imp i need to slash in the assets which is the header and the button cool so we're gonna to select header and button and make exportable to the 3x by png and export the layers and in the desktop, I'm gonna to create new folder. It's called assets and just export into the directory. Cool. So open your asset and you will get the btn submit and header. I'm going to select all of them and copy. And after that, we're gonna to create new Android Studio project and file it code and next, next, and next, and finish. So you just need waiting for the moments to gradle build. Okay, and after that I'm going to RES to paste my drawable sorry, paste my asset into the drawable directory. And we already have BTN submit and the uh, secondly it's called header. Okay. So I'm going to remove this and go to values to go to styles because i don't use the action bar so we're gonna to close it and i want to change the color of the status bar which is the red color so i'm gonna to copy the hex code which is the f14336 now we're going back to the android studio to go to the colors and the color primary dark you're gonna to paste it for the red color and after that, I'm going to images and images view, drag and drop your image. And I'm going to use the header. Okay. And the header, when once you click this header, you will get the properties right here. But if you don't get it, just click these properties. And in the scale type, you should change it to the center crop. Oh, no, sorry. I will use it for the another maybe fit center yeah mm, white i think i'm gonna to use the center crop but i want to make it small so the height is we can copy and go to text dp okay and I'm gonna to setting the margin so we're going back to design and setting the margin margin ref sorry uh, okay and this one we're gonna to setting the margin ref and the margin is zero for the right is zero and here is zero and here is zero okay correct lesson you just create the header for our application <laughs> cool so right now i'm going to go to widgets to get the button here and i'm going to setting the bottom and the right and the left and we go to properties to setting the margin bottom is 53 and the margin right is 53 and the margin left is 53 and change the layout way to the match pattern and then we're going back to the text to change this button to the background so i'm going to create here background and drawable btn submit but as you can see the button it's to pick so we're going to the layout here so setting it to dp okay it's done and then we need to create this paragraph so the font size is 18 pixel and the color we're gonna to copy this and we go to android studio to looking for the text view and just drag and drop here okay and we're gonna to setting setting and setting and the margin top should be 24 and going to the text and here i'm going to change the color 
and the size and I'm gonna to copy the content to here okay and here we're gonna to text element center and spacing maybe 10 dp oh sorry a uh, spacing extra okay and maybe h h okay it's enough cool so the last one is to load our no it's not our but his library into our project so i'm going to copy this just we're gonna to copy first and go to android studio and maybe i will put here below of the text view okay and we go to back here to get the library this one add to dependency we're going to gradle script and build dot gradle and here you can add new one which is called the input view and we're gonna to change well it's done and when never you open this it should be changed so i'm going to design and drag and drop this to here and setting the margin top and margin bottom and right and left cool so i'm going to run this application and i hope it's working properly but let's try okay let's take a look for the emulator Ho! Oh, welcome so we're gonna to click here and two two zero eight nine six so basically this is 22 of august 9 96 this is my birthday <laughs> yeah just maybe around uh four days ago and thanks to me well <laughs> yeah so this is how the code input working in our application and once you click the very final the toss will be coming okay uh yeah, yeah yeah i will show you how it works so we're gonna do text and in the button here i will get the id btn submit and i'm going to main activity here button btn submit and i want to get the btn submit uh, button and find rid btn submit and once btn submit has uh, click so with setting the set on click i'm going to import the class first okay set on click and we gonna to create the toss okay and here your code is valid cool and let's try first into our emulator uh, okay so let's try to open and I'm going to verify your code is valid congratulations okay so thank you very much for watching this video and i hope it's really useful for you because i really really like it well don't forget to like comment or share your opinion about this video because i really appreciate it well nice to meet you from indonesia see you